Hey everybody, it's the Daily Mogul here. Welcome back to Avion the Lost Orb. <clears throat> we are getting towards the end of the game here, aren't we? I'm like, I'm getting to that point where I'm just anxious to finish this. Not because I'm tired of the game, but I'm just ready to like, move on to the final chapter. My god, the inn is expensive here. <clears throat> but yeah, as, as Rachel pointed out, I... No matter how many times I say it, I always end up missing, like, a couple places. So, I hadn't gone into the inn or this building here yet. Uh, Golden Fish? No, I don't think so. She likes to swim in the clear waters there in Asherah's Tomb. Okay. Wow, I missed a quest, too. Man, that's bad. Not only did I miss uh, talking to somebody, but it was actually kind of important. It's not like it was just some random dude who just kind of is a filler and just says whatever. Um, I'm trying to get back to the, the sculptor, though, because I want to check in on how the, uh, yeah, how the nose is going. <laughs> what is it you don't like, Hercules? Please tell us, jerk. The nose, man. It's two inches too long. <laughs> and the guy's totally just playing along. He's not gonna... He's not gonna, like, uh... Turn us in or whatever. God, what... I can't think right now. Well, yeah, Hercules doesn't want it, so... We get to keep it? Or Spook does, at least? <laughs> what is he going to do with it? <clears throat> even if... Yeah, even if the bust wasn't ugly, who wants a bust of Hercules, period? Oh, he gives it to Mel. So, is this another attraction point thing? I guess I'll keep it. Because I don't really know if I want Spook and Mel to be, like, getting together, because... They're both thieves, they seem like they're, like, kind of meant to go together. But there's still some, you know, clearly some things that we don't know about Spook. Like, he really could be a bad guy, for all I know. Alright, but, uh, so let's get out of here. And I think what I'd like to do... ...is head back to the mainland once more. Hmm, welcome back to Chateau Lenore. Yes, quiet. We gotta see how Sienna's doing with her music lessons. Fedor gives us some wine. I guess that's fitting since we used to do his wine deliveries for him. It's too bad he doesn't do that anymore in this game, because... The uh, amount of money he would give us kept doubling. I mean, it probably would have been pretty high by now, so... Um... So what we're supposed to do with the wine from what one of you guys was saying in the comments was take that to, oh, what, the alchemist? And they can make a love potion out of it, I guess? So I'll be doing that. Um, but, uh, yeah. Let me collect all my eggs here and then also collect my thoughts. Because I think there's a little bit more I want to do here on the mainland. Okay, admittedly, I may have looked this up just now, but we're supposed to be able to actually give the... the the bust of Hercules to the museum here, I think. But, uh... I don't know, that didn't work. <laughs> so... He's still concerned about the Golden Frog, which... as I understand, is a quest that I... I goofed up something else earlier in the game, and now I'm not able to finish that quest. So that kind of stinks, but... That happens. And I'll tell you what, since we're in Thias right now, we haven't visited our good old apartment in a, quite a long time. So I'm kind of interested to just see what, what everybody says here. Yeah, Edward's just being all heroic and hopeful. I still can't believe Lydia stole all my stuff, and I'm back in a squishy little apartment. <laughs> well, considering you started with an apartment that was even smaller than this one... I mean... 
I didn't think Mel would ever get used to having a giant mansion. She, she kind of likes... Oops. Sorry about that, I just bumped my microphone a little bit. Oh yeah, you know what? You've learned enough tricks. Uh, we gotta go back to your the, the magician. You're like your mentor or whatever, don't we? Wait, wait, what did you say? <laughs> Jerk. He hates being around us, huh? Can everybody not crowd the front door, please? Can I... Can I leave? Ulf, move your fat ass! Seriously? <laughs> what? Somebody move! Yes! Wow! We haven't visited the post office in quite a long time either. Let's see if we have any mail. Oh, that's right, it's being forwarded to Peliad. Alright. Okay, here's the post office in Peliad. See if we got anything. Indeed there is. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm installing something at the same time I'm recording, which probably isn't the best idea. If you just heard that noise there. This is from Tejal. Dear Mel, I do not like being human. I have made a list of things that I do not like. The list is long, but I know you will not mind. Oh boy. Eating food. It's gross, but necessary. Blood is not easy to find, and it no longer tastes right. I shall wither away soon if I do not find something good to drink. My eyes. They beautifully bloodshot, but now they're violet. I hate them. Tch. I am weak. I can no longer lift Galahad at will. Four. I must do things for myself. I asked a woman to give me her cheese the other day, but she refused. My persuasive glare apparently does not work on humans anymore. Mel, I do not know how I am to survive the weak. <laughs> I can respond? Oh yeah. I want to send a nice one. She's struggling. Yeah. That's good. That's nice of us. I feel good about myself now, don't you? <clears throat> Alright, let's get over to Harakana. So we can mix up that love potion. Now that we're in such a good mood. It just feels right. This feels like the next step. So hopefully the alchemist can do it for us. Since we have Ulf with us. But I guess he could do it anyway. He's He is with us here, so... Whatever. Um, how do I... I want to ask him? No. How do I... Is it because he's still worried about the acid? That might be what it is, huh? Hmm. All right, well, I checked my recipe book, and I tried talking to him every which way, and he doesn't want to do the love potion for us. I guess maybe because the the acid sort of takes priority. That's my, my guess. Excuse me. So we'll come back and do that later. After we get the diamond, I guess it'll be convenient. We'll have to come back here anyway. All right, now I want to get back to... Um, maybe Underfall is better. Because I'd like to try and find that golden fish. And all I know is that the, the fish is supposed to be somewhere in Asher's tomb. Man, it's so nice to be able to move this fast again. This place still gives me the creeps, too. The music is... I mean, just listen to that. <laughs> it's just so disturbing. I love it. Get out of here, crabs. Okay, so we're looking for a golden fish somewhere, huh? And we never did get the chance to use this uh, net or harpoon or whatever it was that we found. Oh. God, I was trying not to sneeze there, and I ran into these guys. <coughs> there it is. Okay, just figured I'd cut the rest of that out. Um, but you know, I don't really remember seeing a, a golden... F 
Oh, there's the golden fish. Never mind. <laughs> I was about to say, I don't remember seeing one when I was in the area before, but... What was... <laughs> what was that sound effect? That was the greatest sound effect I've ever heard. It sounded like you dropped something in the toilet. And I, I, don't, I don't even mean like you dropped your phone in accidentally. I mean, it sounded like someone went number two. All right, I made it past the crabs, very good. I have no interest in fighting. <laughs> I just wanna get through here, man. Back to Fisherman's Horizon. <clears throat> I mean, Acropolis. Hercules is back. The ladies are back. Did his human repellent uh, wear off? He's just back to... He's just telling the same old story that he was before we gave it to him. What a jerk. Man, nothing will stop that guy. Okay, enough complaining. Um... Let's see, it was over here by the inn. Let's go return the golden fish. Fresh fish at a refreshingly fair fair. Here you are. Thank you, friends. Adriana, I have been waiting for you. Who are you talking to? The fish suddenly transforms. Whoa! She's like a shapeshifter, but she can do a fish instead of, like, birds like we can? <laughs> what were you doing swimming in Asherah's tomb when you have, like, the ocean right next to your town? <laughs> it's strange. Oh, I can take the scale? Heck yeah, I'm gonna take it. Haha! <laughs> All right, they're too, they're too busy arguing to care, I guess, that I'm stealing a golden scale. So what the heck is that supposed to be used for, I wonder? If I can find it, maybe it'll tell me. Nope, just a shiny scale. What about my journal? Does that tell me anything? Not really. All right, guys, well, I'm kind of shifting my focus to these uh, caves that are, you know, right off of the city here. So let's try this one first, the Fauna Caves. Oh, it's one of those mushrooms that tricked me last time into thinking he was, like, safe to touch, and then I had to fight him. But he gave me lots of experience. Let's go ahead and try it. A blue mushroom. You're going down, blue mushroom. You're going down. Or not. What is going on? How come that didn't do any damage? Oh, I don't have the right weapons. I forgot about that. Crap, am I screwed? Can I... Can I poison him? And kill him that way? Can I... Can I d d lower his defense? <laughs> I don't know what to do now. Maybe I can use one of my... Uh, spider eggs or something to poison... Poison him. Let's see if that works. Come on, Mel, use it. It just, everything just heals him. Well, I'm glad I saved it before I did this, because I might, I might have to kill the game and start over. I mean, crap. Yeah, you know what, let me do that. All right, so I learned my lesson. I am not going to fight any enemies in here if I can help it because 
I don't think I can. I don't have the right weapons, right? I mean, I don't know if that rule only applies to the mushrooms or the creepy spider-looking things as well, but... <clears throat> I mean, my only obstacle to getting the weapons I need is money. So I'd love to try and get that money bag over here. Without getting myself killed again. Or trapped, I should say. Trapped in a fight that I can never win. Cool. Uh, I don't know if I can make it past there right now. <clears throat> Let's go around the long way. Oh boy, they can go down the stairs. Not good. Hey, Pixies! Come here, Pixies! Can I catch them in my empty bottles? Actually, I think these are the same Pixies we saw earlier. Really? How did they make it all the way here? Oh, they just decided they would come and play tricks on Acropolis instead. Hey, want to do something devious? I bet the circus would like creatures like this. We can use a bottle to catch them. Oh, that's right. The circus near Tiobi, they were looking for another act for one of their tents. Oh, no. I need one more empty bottle. Dang it, man. I only have four bottles. And I... Well... Uh, I was going to say, I really need those spiders to go away. Somehow I darted right past them. Pretty risky, I gotta say. Ooh, there's a save thing. Not a save thing, but a heal thing. Ain't nothing but a heal thing. So does that mean there's a boss up ahead, or is this just, uh... Is this just a kind of a... A goody cave of sorts. Meaning, like, there's really nothing to do here. There's just treasure. I don't know why the spiders can't... Like, it looks like they get stuck right there. And I don't know why that is, but I'm not going to complain. Looks like I just got some good armor. Is that for Edward? Nice. Can anybody else equip that? Yvette can. Yeah, let's go ahead and put it on her. That's a huge defense boost. Awesome. Oh, everybody needs those new weapons, though, man. I mean, I probably have enough money to buy one, maybe two now, thanks to just what I've found so far. But... I might have to do a little bit of grinding before I do the next video just to earn some more money. Or just go and sell some more stuff. I mean, I know I have a lot of stuff in my inventory. And as you guys know, I do tend to hoard my stuff. <clears throat> Here's the guy. All right, so what can we buy here? Wait, it's just the staff. So I can get that for June, but I thought I thought I could buy more weapons than that from this guy. It's all just Dang it, I did it again. I hit the mic. But the rest of it's just armor. Well, yeah, I'll get the staff for sure. And I guess I could buy the helmets. They're pretty cheap. But now nah, I'll, I'll save it, whatever. At least this way one person will be able to actually damage the enemies in there. It's better than nothing. Um, yeah, you know what? Let me go back in there because I think there was one spot that I didn't explore now that I think about it. Man, just like in the towns, I'm, I'm becoming infamous for missing areas and dungeons too, I think. Yeah, this treasure chest right here. Oh, it's just an elixir. Well, that was the only thing I thought of. There, maybe there was something deeper in here, too, though. Let me just do one final sweep. No, that's where the pixies were. Okay. 
Come on, spiders, get out of my way. All you gotta do is be patient, because at least in this dungeon, there's, like, the areas are wide enough where you can do that. In a lot of the dungeons, it was like, it's like this, where it's like, there's only enough room for one thing to be to be going there, you know? And there's just no way around them. I mean, that's... That's one reason why I got stuck and had to use uh, the save file editor earlier. Because I... As soon as I tried to go back through the dungeon, I ran into one of those hallways where I just couldn't get around those two enemies. And I was in such bad shape, I just... There was, it was impossible for me to win the fight. But, um... I guess I'll just head up here towards the next cave. I, be I believe we explored the other one thoroughly enough. But we still have the mana caves here. And I do have to find one more empty bottle. I'm kind of concerned about that, because... I mean, I really wasn't even paying attention to the empty bottles that I had as far as, like, where I got them from. They just... You just sort of get them... As long as you're opening all the treasure chests and, like, being somewhat diligent throughout the game, you'll pretty much end up with the four bottles like I did, but... I guess I, I gotta find a fifth bottle somewhere. But, I think I'm gonna end this video here, guys. Thanks so much for watching. We'll explore the mana caves and, uh... I guess try to wrap up, you know, some more of these quests. Uh, I'll go back to the circus after I find that last bottle, get the pixie, and we'll work on getting the diamond for these two, and that'll be it. All right, see you guys later. Bye-bye. Hey guys, it's the Daily Moogle. Thanks so much for watching my video. I hope you liked it, and if you did, let me know and let YouTube know by clicking that like button. Below, you can also subscribe, and you'll see more videos in the future that way. To my left, there's a link to my Facebook page, and on the other side, you can actually download the game that I'm currently playing. It is an affiliate link, so you'll be supporting not only my channel, but the game developer as well. Thanks again. I'll see you in the next one.